Okay, this is this is a new product. This is our sweeper. Um, it's it's designed to unload a Gaylord, a full Gaylord. Where of course the demonstration here is just a, a cut down one, so we can show you that. But uh, it takes our standard stands that we've been manufacturing all along. This portion is to guide it over the material so that it doesn't just bury itself. The brushes are to slowly urge the plastic to the outside edge and the pickup wand is to vacuum up the material on the outside edge. Step over here. There's a jog button so you can jog it around. It has a, has a very slow speed drive motor in here. The unit is geared to drive at about 2 RPMs, so it, it turns very slowly. It only comes on when the vacuum motor runs. We have a vacuum switch inside, and when, you, when it detects a vacuum, it turns the motor on, very small motor inside here, low speed, and rotates the, around and, and basically vacuums up material, and as the material is consumed, it just, it just goes to the bottom. It generally leaves uh, a little bit of plastic in the corners, uh, I would say uh, 5 or 10 or 15 pounds at most. When it's done, you can raise it up, you can come in with a fork truck, bring this out, put your new one in, and then take your bag that has the 10 or 15 pounds, pull that out and dump that into the new one. So you don't waste any pellets at all because you're down to a to a five or ten pounds which is manageable for an operator to just simply transfer in the, the fork truck operator it's a it's a very simple unit and very reliable so that's uh, it's really the basic product it, it, as far as um, the payback we we estimate that most consumers, most, most processors are wasting about 20 minutes of labor per Gaylord to monitor the last little, to, get, to keep the pile at the bottom and get the last little bit out. 20 minutes of labor, if you take a, a value of the labor as low as say $20 an hour total cost, and if you consume, if you use one Gaylord every shift, then you've paid for this unit in about four months. Payback like that, payback like that is hard to find.